Hello, this is Dr. Jeetan Bendor for Physician Perspectives. I'd like to talk about an interesting topic, osteoporosis and sarcopenia, increased frailty syndrome in the elderly. What we know is that world population is aging and the increase in life expectancy is often unhealthy. In particular, musculoskeletal aging, which leads to sarcopenia and osteoporosis, has several causes such as changes in body composition, inflammation and hormonal imbalance. It is important to understand that sarcopenia, osteoporosis and more frequently sarcopenic obesity are commonly associated with aging and frequently closely linked with each other often leading to the development of a frailty syndrome. So frailty syndrome fair favors rather an increased risk of loss of function in daily activities for cardiovascular diseases, cancers, falls and mortality. As the number of elderly continues to increase, it is important to identify people at risk of frailty early and to treat and or prevent its damages, developing interventions that can promote a successful aging. The complexity and heterogeneity of frailty syndrome requires a multidimensional clinical approach based on healthy nutrition, psychosocial well-being, regular physical exercise and pharmacological measures which seem to prevent and control chronic diseases affecting both life expectancy and quality of life thereby reducing mortality. Since frailty syndrome is not much talked about and not much debate is seriously happening about this important topic, the authors conclude saying that new basic and clinical studies are necessary to better understand the complex pathophysiological mechanisms leading to frailty and to carry out effective measures of interventions to prevent its development and treat its damages. Thank you.